Okay, now we're going to look at counting waves. Before we do that, you're going to tell me what the wavelength and amplitude is of this wave. So, how many boxes? I think I've kept it the same, haven't I? The wavelength is two centimetres. Now the amplitude, I've drawn the arrow, the full height of the wave. Now, they might do that in an exam or a test to confuse you. Do you remember that the amplitude isn't the full height of the wave? It's half the height of the wave, which is one, two, sorry, one, two, three boxes. So the amplitude here is 1.5 centimetres. Now, what I'm going to be teaching you today is how to count waves. And you either do that from trough to trough, from crest to crest, or using the pattern repeat. So how you do it here, you start here, this is zero waves, we haven't had any waves yet. By the time we've got here, we've got one complete wave, and here, two complete waves. So I want you to tell me how many waves I've drawn here. Pause the video if you want time to think. Okay, so we start here, zero waves have happened. One, two, three. So that is three waves. Now with this one, I've kept it the same, so we've still got a wavelength of two centimetres. And the amplitude is still the same. But this time we're going to count from crest to crest. Still two waves. One, two. How many waves are here? Have a little time to think. Just one. So you've got one wave. Here, we're going to use the pattern repeat. Now, I like to use a pencil for this one in this way, sweeping with the wave. So you're going one wave, two waves. So all of them are two waves, just drawn slightly differently. One wave, two waves. So how many waves are here? Pause the video if you want time to think. One, two and a half. So this is 2.5 waves. Okay. Now, I've got some questions to finish off here. What is the wavelength of this wave? What is the amplitude? And how many waves are there? Give you a time to think, pause the video, answer the questions, and then check if you're right. Well, the wavelength is two boxes. So that is going to be Whoops, pen's not working. One centimetre. The amplitude is two boxes. So the amplitude is also one centimetre. How many waves are there? Well, we're going to use the pattern repeat method. So that's one, two. There are going to be three waves. Now, looking at the same questions for this diagram here, what is the wavelength? Pause the video again and answer the three questions. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight boxes. So the wavelength is four centimeters. What is the amplitude? Well, here's the midpoint. So we're going up one, two, three, four. So the amplitude is two centimeters. How many waves are there? Well, it's a difficult to know where to start because it finishes on a crest, but it starts on a trough. That is a hint that it's not a full whole number of waves. We've got one wave here, and then we've got another half. You can use a pattern repeat method as well. One and a half. So 1.5 waves in that diagram. Bye.